Hey everybody, we're playing some Pokemon Go. We're here on, I think, still on Island Six. Um, we got the we got the mission done here, but there's a few more um, basically locations that we have to explore um, to get a couple more new Pokemon, and then we could probably dip. So I'm heading over to the bushed area so I can grab a few more Pokemon. Ooh, Chinchu. That's a new Pokemon. We've never seen that before. Let's go ahead and use Psychic on it. I think that'll work. Or are we going to the right place? I don't think we're going to the forested area now, but we're going somewhere, that's for sure. So we'll, I guess we'll figure it out as we go, to be honest. Alright, Lantern. We can go ahead and Psychic again, and that'll, that'll, that'll be fine. Need some good levels here. Ooh, okay, I was scared. I'm like, is it not going to one-shot? Horsey's level 26. We're, get, we're getting there to Cedra. Slowly but surely. Oh, I knew this would happen. Did you know? Alright, we got a few more swimmers to beat. Kinda cool. I would love to catch you, but I don't really need you. I already have both your Pokedex and trees. What are you suggesting that you're sick of seeing swimmers? Oh, don't be hating. I'm not tired of swimmers. I'm not really tired of anything, to be honest. Oh, only one, and he has a Gyarados. Level 50 Gyarados. Interesting. All right. Well, let's go ahead and use a Thunder on it. Don't miss. Good job. Thank you. Okay. I think we might be wasting our time going north. I just... I've got the wiki open, and apparently there's not anything up here that's very useful. Maybe? No, maybe I am wrong. What is this place? Hello, Pokemon, it's time to battle. Maybe I- oh, man, these islands are, are confusing. I'm always getting lost between all the- What the heck was that noise? That's a very weird noise right then. Pikachu and Pikachu. Oh, and they're both level 50. Why don't you evolve them to Raichu? All right, go ahead and surf all of them. And we can go ahead and fly here. Surf will kill both of them for sure, so. Honestly, I just need Pidgey out of the way. There we go. All right, Horsey's gonna gain some levels. Alright, we defeated you. You're mean. <laughs> no, you challenged me, bud, so get over it. My height is 67 inches on the button. I know it is this precisely because my neighbor measured me. Uh, cool, my guy. I mean, that is pretty sick. Oh, these are all trainers? I let a pleasant breeze lead me all the way here. I thought this was like a friendly island. Oh, apparently this is like trainers here too. All right, two. Sunkern. Yeah, I'm, I'm, it's cool to see all of these trainers, but they have at least like new Pokemon and stuff. So like we can kind of like fill our Pokedex with seen Pokemon. I like the way this was designed. I honestly, I kind of have to give it to the game. Um, just the way this entire game was designed, I really like it. Um. I'm slightly biased because this was the first Pokemon game I ever played as, even as a kid. But playing it again now, I'm taking a look at the things we're doing, the way the world was built, the way they block... Giggle, you're so cute when you're determined. The way they block stuff off and open stuff off. I gotta give it to the game. I think they did a great job. Hera, Hera Cross. Big and shiny. It's a bug boss. Love it. Need it. Hera Cross. Okay, well, we'll definitely catch one of those. Gotta kind of find our way wherever we're going. Okay, so we can go down the green path over here. Or we can quickly surf to grab an item. Yes, please surf. I want to go ahead and quickly grab an item over here. I found an elixir. Funk. Alright, now we can go ahead and go through the green path. That's a good thing I didn't use a repel, because I think we'll find stuff here. 
Ooh, pattern bush. Okay. And there's a lot of trainers in here, I think. How many? There's... There's a lot of trainers in here. I bet you think I'm just some guy, don't ya? I mean, tiny bit, bud, but... Because you're, like, a child, but... Alright, we got far-fetched. I'm guessing these are all... And it's, okay, this is nice, because they're all very high level. This will provide some good levelage for Horsey, which you guys know. I'm trying to get into Cedra. It's one of the last, actually, just straight up evolution Pokemon that I need for my Pokedex. I don't know why I kind of, like, I neglected Horsey throughout the game. Now I'm kind of, like, at the islands trying to fully evolve it while we're doing other things. Alright. Who are we facing here? We got a Farfetch'd. Cordell. Alright, Horsey, level 28. Youngster Cordell, I bet you think I'm weak, don't ya? Well, I mean, you kind of proved it just then, bud. Alright, well, we got a lot of people to face here, so I guess we'll just, um, we'll keep going here, huh? What we got next? Garrett. Ooh, he has a Heracross. That is a pretty cool and strong Pokemon you got there, bud. I wish I could steal it from ya. Let's go ahead and use Surf. Yeah, Surf will be good here. Very nice, very nice. Alright, we defeated Garrett. Yeah, that, that hair cross was pretty cool though, bud. Alright, let's see if we can encounter some of the Pokemon that we need. Yes, there is a first one, a Ladybug. That is a new Pokemon that we can go ahead and take from its home. And raise it to fight other animals. Which is wonderful. Wow, Ladybug. That's not very nice of you. How about you stay in the ball next time? Yep, and then we need two other Pokemon in this area. One, two, three. Here we go. Alright, Ladybug, thank you for staying in the ball. It is very timid. It will be afraid to move if it is alone, but it will be active if it is in a group. So you're telling me I need to catch more Ladybug. We can get it, so we can get it a group going here. Right, I'm looking for Spinnerark and of course Heracross. But in the meanwhile, we'll go ahead and uh, defeat a lot of these trainers. All right, here we go. There's the rare Heracross. Okay. Um, I didn't expect to hit it so early, but I mean, yes. Right, let's start chucking Ultra Balls at it. It'll be a little bit of a harder catch. Okay, that wasn't very nice of you. Or an attack. That didn't do much. Alright, let's keep throwing Ultra Balls while I respond to a text. Let me also turn down my... Go ahead and turn down my volume. Brick break. That's not very nice of you. Alright. Here we go. Another Ultra Ball. Um. Okay. More Ultra Balls. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh! You baiter. Another ball. One, two, three. Aw, oh, you, you absolute baiter, dude. Alright, well, well, we'll keep taking the abuse as it run, as it jumps out of balls. One. Music is bopping, though. Chilling. How many balls have we thrown at it? We've probably thrown a, a, good, a good couple balls. One. Okay. Wow. Hit a maximum of five. 
what a what a lucky guy this Heracross is, huh? One, two. is broken out of a lot of balls, man. Ultra Balls here, man. Did we get it? Man, I think I can have a whole conversation while it attacks. thrown too many ultra balls at this like this is actually like unlucky at this point like this is not this is not normal even i know it's not damage but like this is really not normal we've thrown like 20 ultra balls actually like i could feel like a little bit of anger boiling up like this is like actually like pretty dumb at this point like Really, dude? You're a bug Pokemon at level 25. I'm refusing to damage this Heracross. I will be catching it full. There you freaking go, dude. It took way too long for that. This powerful Pokemon thrusts its prized horn under its enemy's belly, then lifts them and throws them. Cool, Heracross. I am now angry at you, and I will not be using you because I am angry at you. Love poke I love bug Pokemon. Am I the only girl like that? Oh no, a pick me girl. That's not that's not very cool. Joanna. Ooh, a snibble. That's also a new Pokemon. Let's go ahead and uh, surf on it. Very nice. I'm lost, but I'm still laughing. Am I the only girl like that? Oh, oh lord. I got beat while I was still busy. Okay, start me. Oh, hey, here we go. Horsey's evolving. I didn't realize Horsey would evolve right now. I thought it was a little while later. 
But hey, um, let's go ahead and take this evolution. We've been working on it basically the entire time on these islands, so um, that's pretty cool. Finally get ourselves that Seedra, fill in another spot on that Pokedex, and we're almost done. Congratulations, your horse seed evolved into a Seedra. Now what we can go ahead and do is uh, take that XP share off, and we can go ahead and give that XP share to Sentret. Because we need to evolve Sentret too. Let's go ahead and give it to Sentret. There we go. And Sentret should evolve very, very quickly here. Oh, and Sentred's evolving already. Wow, that was very quick. What? Sentred's evolving? Alright, well, now we don't have a Pokemon to give the XP share to. Unless... Oh, no, even if the Eevee evolves, we don't really need to give it an XP share. There we go, now we have... a Furret. Which is pretty cool. Alright, let's go to Pokemon, but luckily, I think that's basically all of the trainers here. So we don't really need anyone else to have one. Um, do I have a Max Revive? Doesn't look like I have a Max Revive. Alright, we got a few more fights. Take a deep breath. Isn't the air delicious? We got a few more fights to go here. single Pokemon or trainer in here and that is the exact Pokemon that we're looking for spinner arc and that is the last one so perfect timing on that one we just finished up the trainers now we can finish up the Pokemon and make our way out of here one two now oh, you butthead please do not tell me he's gonna be like hair across and take I think over 25 ultra balls to get I don't think so, because Heracross is notoriously a butthead, but that's fine. One, two, three, here we go. Good stuff, good stuff. It lies still in the same pose for days in its web, waiting for its unsuspecting prey to wander close. Alright, we can go ahead and get out of this place, we no longer need it. Of course, we get an encounter right before we dip ski, and that's a Kakuna, which I do not need. Gonna run away. So now, if we run here, we can make our way over to an island, which um, basically is completely useless. But we will travel there for completion's sake. That's it. Just for completion's sake. We run over here, we come to... Huh? I was envisioning my house, but this is where I teleport? <laughs> Does she have an Abra? What do you have? Ooh, Natu. Okay. Natu teleport her somewhere she didn't want to go? Um, I like having... Is that all, or is there... Okay, there is more. Okay. Outcast Island. Oh, we got another trainer here. Can I fight you? It's not so easy sending Pokemon out while swimming, you know. I didn't think about that, but you're right. You have to, like... Eh. What do you got? Meryl? Better be a high-level Meryl. Level 50 Meryl? You're nuts. Alright, let's go ahead and thunder it. And you missed. Hydro Pump. That's a good move. Not gonna do anything. Alright, come on. There you go. I'm like, don't miss, Starmie, please. Skirt. Super effective. 
Alright, we defeated Sora and Nicole. Only $400. I guess you can't keep change on you while in the water, but... Okay. Um... Let's go and fight you. Let's have a two-on-two -two marine battle. Okay. Why not? What do you got? Poliwhirl and Starmie? Those are pretty cool Pokemon. I got one of those myself. We're gonna go ahead and Thunder you. And then Aerial Ace it. There we go. You didn't miss. Good job, Starmie. Starmie v Starmie. The mine is better. Super effective. Alright, good you. Level 45. It's not, okay, it's not going to kill it. That's fine. Let's go out and bring out... Nobody. Never mind. Okay. Nope. Ah, come on. What about... Thunder it. I'm going to have to waste the Thunder here, but... Just because Starmie's going to be faster than Pidgeot, naturally. So... Oh, you're amazing. Even better on your own. Okay, how many... Do we got a lot more swimmers? Yes, but swam here from six aisle port in one go. Dang, you're nuts. Alright, we just we defeated this guy with um, absolutely no PP left, which is hilarious to me. Yeah, with Outcast Island. Ooh, there's an item here. Found a PP up. Hey, look at that. I'm having no luck at all. A battle be... A good change of pace. Hey, that is a new Pokemon, Quillfish. We haven't seen that one. Oh, Quillfish is the exclusive for Fire Red. Well, we get Remorade. Let's go ahead and uh, struggle on it. Bonk. You have been struggled upon. Okay. I'm about to use Quillfish. Let's go ahead and change Pokemon. Go ahead and go over to Pidgeot. Okay, so that is all on that side. What if we go over to here? Oh, we got a Team Rocket guy. And then an Altering Cave. I'm pretty sure there's actually nothing in here. I'm pretty sure there's only Zubat in here. Yeah, so let's let's double check that hypothesis. I'm pretty sure there's only Zubat. Um, yeah, there's only Zubat. I think this was a place where you could go to catch Pokemon during an event, but that event didn't happen, or it happened, but just not in the United States. So there's actually nothing here to catch. It's just Zubat. So let's go ahead and put on a Repel. Let's make sure there's no items or anything in here, but I don't think there is. Yep, there's, there's literally nothing in here. So we basically just kind of wasted our time coming here. That's not that big of a deal. There's no rare Pokemon on these parts. Not a one. That burns me up, man. I'll take it out on you. Um, yeah. There's... Because it's an event place. So... Alright, we stole 3k from this dude. Um, but I'm pretty sure that's the entirety of the island. There is nothing else to check out. Yes, that is everything. We can go ahead and ch even check with Pidgey. We are at the top. We did all that. We did there. There's the Dotted Valley. We did all that. So... Um, we can technically now go ahead and make go over back to five islands. Okay, guys, we're going to go ahead and end this episode off here, though, guys. Thanks for watching.